channel hey and welcome to canvas fashions please go ahead and click that subscribe button and also click on the little bell down below which will give you a notification when i upload new videos i would love to have you part of the canvas fashions family where you can learn some makeup tricks that i've been using over the past few years that i would love to share with you guys and to my old subscribers welcome back i'm so glad that you can join me for today's video so today we're going to be doing a makeup tutorial for for if you want to look good in five minutes so now this is for people that are on the run busy in the morning and want to look put, put together but just don't have the time so I'm gonna use some simple drugstore products that you can um, purchase at any drugstore and it's simple it's easy enough to achieve at home it's a nice glowy makeup look still a little bit natural and yeah just something that i'm always wearing every single day especially if i'm on the run and i still want to look put together there's not a lot of makeup going on but there's a lot of glow so yeah i hope you're gonna enjoy this video let's just get started so i'm first starting out with my witch hazel rose water to just freshen up my face and just um, act as like a base and then i'm going to fill in my brows now with this quick and easy tutorial you don't want to focus too much like precision on your brows it's just about filling in the sparse areas and you are just creating where you want your brows to look and then um, I'm just going to carve it out with my LA Girl concealer in the shade Fawn and I'm not focusing too much on carving it out it's trying to make it as natural as possible and then we're going to blend it out with a concealer brush and yeah that's just gonna define your brows a little bit more next up we're going to prime our face and add a bit of a glow so i'm using the maybelline baby skin primer and then the yardley luster glow drops and this is just gonna create a bit of a glow underneath my foundation so my face looks glowy and just gives that natural glow underneath my foundation so the foundation that I'm using is my LA Girl Pro Illuminating Coverage Foundation. Now this is one of my favorite foundations at the moment and a little bit goes a long way. So I just put a few pumps on my face and I'm blending it with my Tarte Kabuki brush. Now make sure to blend it all the way down your neck, on your ears, just so it looks like a flawless canvas for your face. And yeah, I love this foundation because it gives you that fresh face look. So I'm priming my lips with my Vaseline Intensive Care um, Vaseline Balm and then I'm going to conceal any blemishes with my Black Opal Total Coverage Concealing Foundation. So just concealing blemishes and underneath my eyes and yeah I like the coverage of this. So you don't want to put too much concealer, you still want to look fresh faced and awake. And then I'm just going to bronze up my face with my Essence Compact Mattifying Powder in the shade True Mahogany. And I'm just going to apply this to my cheekbones, to my jawline, down the, my nose and then on my hairline. And this is just going to add a bit more colour to my face so I don't look too flat and um, like too mattified. So yeah, this is just going to bronze it up. And then for my eyes, I'm using that same bronzer just to add a bit of colour to my eyelids. And then applying mascara. Now this is one of my favorite mascaras at the moment. It's the Essence False Lashes Mascara. It just opens your eyes so perfectly, especially if you have long lashes. This is just going to elongate it even more. So just coat your bottom and top lashes with this mascara. And it's going to open your eyes a bit and make you look more awake. And then adding a cream liner to your lower lash line is going to also make your eyes look more awake and yeah for blush i'm using the bodyography sunkiss um, blush and i'm just adding a little bit to the apples of my cheeks just for some color to my face and then to set my t-zone i'm using the innisfree no sebum powder so this absorbs any oil um, on your face and then to highlight i'm using the la girl strobe light palette in the shade 80 watt 
and I'm just gonna highlight the points of my cheeks, my nose, my cupid's bow and just above my brows and my chin and this is just gonna intensify the glow that we've put underneath our, our foundation. I'm then going to use that same eye, uh, that same strobing powder to highlight the inner corners of my eyes. This is just gonna make your eyes look more awake and highlight it a little bit more. And then for lips, it's, I'm using the Essence Lip Liner Pencil in the shade In The Nude. So we want this to be a more natural look, so I'm going for natural lips. And this is the Wet n Wild Mega Last Lipstick in the shade Mockalicious and this is just going to finish off the look to make it as neutral as possible. It's the perfect Marvy tone lipstick ever. And then highlighting my cupid's bow with the same strobing palette from LA Girl. And to set my whole face I'm using the MAC um, Fix Plus Spray. And this is the completed look. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's just a quick simple easy tutorial if you are on the run and you are rushing out the house and you want to still look put together especially if you're a mom or if you just want to look like you've put your face together that morning then this look is perfect to achieve it's a nice glow to the skin as well as very natural as well so i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i hope everyone's having an amazing festive season i know i'm not going to be uploading a lot of videos um towards the end of the year just because baby atara will be coming soon so when this video goes up she may be here already so yeah we don't know but i love you guys so much thank you so much for all the support and love on my channel over the past yeah, I love you guys. Stay blessed and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.